Hi, this time on the video I thought I would show a couple of techniques I use for controlling my tremor. The first, as you saw before, was where I hold my hand and that really helps me and I think it's because it keeps me a little bit rigid with my arm against my side like this and helps me, you know, just keep that little bit of control with that bracing against my my body. But something else I noticed as I was just starting this painting is that um, I move my whole body rather than just trying to reach out and which I, I haven't got any control once I'm extended. So I tend to, as I'm drawing these lines, I'm moving across. So it makes it um, more of a whole, yeah, whole body movement. So um, I'll see if I can do it and get it right in front of the camera. So um, I've done all the underpainting on this piece and now I'm building up the layers of all the textures, so the different um, colours and textures all start coming through to the front. And I'm working on this fissure series where they have these beautiful cracks and pieces of rock which you can see have just been forced up through um, the geological forms. And that's what's really got me going at the moment. So um, I'll just continue with this bit and uh, I'll move the easel over a little bit. I'm not sure whether you'll be able to see very clearly, but um, here we go. So I tend to do this just random. There's not much, not much um, planning goes into these paintings. I just feel so this way I'm, I'm moving my whole body and I do tend to move the height of the canvas to, um, to keep what I'm doing at this arm height. So, you know, you can see that I'm not, I can keep the end of the paintbrush fairly controlled, although every now and again I have a bit of a wobble, which helps with uh, when you're an abstract painter because you can just change it as you go along to suit those bits where the wobble is. So there's a couple of techniques that if you've got a tremor, um, holding and also just that bit of bracing as well as moving your whole body, just bending your knees and going from side to side to and um, of course I do it a lot better when nobody's watching. Okay, talk to you next time. Bye. I'll try and switch it off now.